Hey, 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 everybody, how's it going? It's the Otter Samurai here, back with more Black Mirror. Last episode, we uh, wandered throughout the castle grounds, or mansion grounds, I should say, uh, trying to find Angus to get a key to go to the cellar so we could figure out, uh, find the clues to solving the maid's murder. And we ended up wandering around for like... Must be upstairs somewhere. Yes, I know, I'm going. So after wandering around lost for God knows how long, we decided to... Well, that's clear enough. Oh, God, my nose is so stuffy. I hate this. Sorry. Uh, we finally find the clues. We find a locket thanks to some ghost power. And we confronted Eddie, and Eddie's like, Oh, God, I'd have been doing this. So pathetic. I'm such a fat child. Please don't hate me. I got pizza face all over. Oh, God. So now we gotta go find Eddie in his room. Maybe in the attic. I don't know. I could be wrong. Probably wrong. Oh, excuse me! Oh, hey, no, I'm right. Ooh, this is disgusting. Well, hello, my dear Elsa. Oh, Sir Edward. You look very handsome today. Eddie? Why, thank you. You're as beautiful as ever, my little doll. Oh. <laughs> Mwah. Mwah. Well, aren't you the crazy one? Man, this is a disgusting attic. Do they ever clean? Yay! More photo pieces. Hey, Eddie, you okay? Eddie, can you hear me? What can you tell me about Great Grandmother Rose? What did Elsa have to do? Eddie! Eddie! How can you just sit there and become a pizza? Oh god, a cross! The scariest image in Celtic horror. What you see here, Eddie? A cross? be quite safe, the little rabbit said to his brothers and sisters. The fox is fast asleep, so the rabbits tiptoed past, but the fox was sly. He wasn't asleep at all. Oh, jeez! to mind your place. This will be the last time you defy me! Oh, damn! Damn, that's a cold hard killing for a granny. The eyes of the fox they shone with cruel light as he punched on the rabbits and ate them all one by one. Get off me! It was only then he went to sleep, his tummy full, his heart content. I don't want to get fucked by a pervert pizza face! Get off of me! Jesus. I wonder what's on the other side. Is there... Uh, no? Can't see a switch or lever. I guess not all castles are like Edgar Allan Poe used to describe them. Eddie lied to me! Damn you, Edgar Allan Poe! <laughs> How could you lie to me, Edwar Edgar? Oh, hey. A secret passage. What do you think you're doing? That won't be long, I hope. Look after ready. We'll grab the candle. We're gonna be able to see in there, don't we? Oh damn! Look Just at his. a little further. Ooh, damn! He thick boy. Ew! Ew! Rat! Gross! I like rats. Rats are kind of cute, but I only like domesticated rats. I don't like feral rats. Feral rats are like ugh. Damn creepy. It. Oh boy. Well, I'm trapped here now. Great. Can't go back the way I came. But still, I got my thick ass. 
<laughs> Leah, help me. That's it. Open wide. Good, good. I don't I want any. Oh, That's she's still alive. All right, dear. Did I tell you that John's son David has arrived? He's as balsam as his father. Not worthy of this place. Poor Angus will never recover from the sight of John's charred remains. Selfish, selfish man. Please. Don't. Let me live. I, I want to die. I enjoy this, as you well know. But you brought it on yourself. Your son was a good man. You should not have defied him. <coughs> Ew. Rosemary. Oh my god. Sorry. She's pelly skin and bones. How is she still alive? Tell me the switch it was in the bookcase. You scared me half to death. Well, you will insist on wandering off without telling me where you're going, and I just managed to avoid Lady <coughs> Margaret when she <coughs> suspect. <laughs> Sorry, give me a sec, you guys. Sorry about that. <clears throat> I saw this. In the vision. Edward beat her with it. Used it to cripple the poor woman. Oh my god. And he hung it there to remind her every day. Take it down. <coughs> You're sure? Do it. All right. Get rid of a cross. Sorry. I don't, I don't know what the hell happened there. It's like, bleh. Thank you. Thank you. It's okay, Rosemary. We got you, girl. We're going to take care of you, girl, okay? Wait, wait, wait. Don't break your legs. Oh, thank God. I thought he was going to pull a misery on her. God. That scared me for a second. I'm like, don't beat an old lady's legs. She's already suffered enough. Rosemary, I'm David. <coughs> Johnson, your great grandson. Here, the best. Try this. No, like this. Gently. Who did this to you? <coughs> I guess I'm still ugh. bad. I disobeyed. No, you're a good girl. Disobeyed? How did you disobey? Cecilia, I tried to stop him. Stop. Now watch as I sink into my pillow. What was he doing, Rosemary? Should not hey, welcome to the show. Disappeared. <laughs> not disturb him in the old wing. Never talk. <coughs> so what you missed so far is uh. Jo uh, Rose, David's grandmother Rose, here. What grandfather. Did you do to Cecilia? I don't think you'll get anything more out of her. Poor woman. This is Rosemary, his uh, great grandmother. She got crippled by her son, David's on, Godfa Rosemary. grandfather. Because we'll he was being here. a dick to her. No. And so she was trapped here the whole time. We can get you somewhere safe. I'm safe here in this room. Safe from the black mirror. <laughs> I 
<laughs> was the what, mirror. what the hell? Margaret has a lot to explain. That I don't think the mouth movement was necessary. Uh, just for exhaling a death breath there. I think we need to have words with her ladyship. Beat her ass! I know she's an old lady, but she could probably still fight. <laughs> Go on her ass, Mortal Kombat style. We'll finish her! Oh god, that was close. Wait, wait, don't... Oh, thank god. Lady Margaret, what the hell's wrong with you? Margaret, we need to talk about... Lady Margaret, if you please. No. Never mind that. What the hell are you doing with Rosemary? <coughs> to talk. You're just like your father, leaving nothing but fear and misery in your wake. I'm what finding the God's truth. What name are you talking about? You spoke to young Eddie, did you not? Now he's convinced everyone is trying to kill him. He has taken poor Andrew hostage and is threatening his life. Where is he? He's taken him to the old wing, and he is armed. I'm armed too. I, I got two arms. See? I can talk to him. You will not. You two have caused quite a <coughs> trouble already. Sorry, guys. We? How dare you? When you continue to worship Edward, even though he drove poor Cecilia to drown herself. I will not allow you to. To what? To speak the truth. To say that Edward is a monster. He never touched her. You come here. And you... No, you. You are the one in the wrong here. Yeah. You know more than you're saying, and we both know it. There's something in this place. An evil that has plagued our family for generations. Instead of blaming others, maybe you should look closer to home for the cause of your misfortune. Damn straight, lady. You know nothing. What I did, what I do, everything, <coughs> everything... Is for this family. How can you possibly understand? Please, my lady, we can discuss this later. Miss Farber, you need to speak to Master Eddie. Take us to him. Only Dr. Lear, not you. You forbidden from being in my house. This isn't your house anymore, old bitch. This is my house. This way. Uh, have a care you old, the old wing. It isn't used, and for good reason. A section of wall fell into the sea some years back, and the rest is falling to ruin. Oof. Eesh. Well, everything's horrible right now. Alright, here we go. Oh shit! He wasn't kidding! How could a small child overpower him? Eddie? No! No! They're after me! All of them! They're after me, Lucky Charms! No! Please help! Eddie, look at me, Eddie, just at me. It's going to be all right. Stay back here. I'll try to reason with it. You will not. This yeah. is what I do. Yeah, leave it to the doctor. She That's her plan, stupid. <coughs> here, go, go solve puzzles. Try to see if Eddie? you can find more photo pieces. Talk to me, Eddie. Tell me what's troubling you. Troubling me? He is! And David! They all are! Oh, she's good. They all are what, she's Eddie? She's distracted. But I'm Accusing me! Him into dropping the they think I killed her! He seems too far gone for that. The maid, you mean? But I didn't! Oh, I what? didn't! I might make it, but... I believe I you, Eddie. Me. I believe you. I'm in panic. <clears throat> What are you doing? One more step, and I kill him! Hold on! Okay, okay. Everybody's stuck in frozen time. It'll be safe! 
Ah, damn it! <laughs> Austin, stay away! <laughs> it's not a threat, I'll kill him! <laughs> now will you listen to me? No. Wanted to examine that spot. What, what, what was the thingy? <laughs> Eddie, if you go shoot somebody, shoot me. I'm the one accused you, remember? Oh, shit. We're all the way back here? God damn. Okay. I, th I think we need to cut through all this again. Holy shit. Ooh. Lady Margaret. What the hell's your problem, you angry old bitty? Margaret. Lead. Never mind. You're right. What in you spoke? Where is he's I'll go. You we I will You to <laughs> never You come No You come, I come. You no Please, my lady, we take us to him. <laughs> You come! No! Not for you, you old lady. For Dr. Leah, yes, but not for you, you old bitty. This way. <laughs> this way. Into another cutscene. Not yet. Over there, sir. Eddie? No! No! They're after me! All of them! Trying to kill me! No! Please help! Eddie, look at me, Eddie, just at me. It's okay. going to be all right. Can't skip this. Stay back here. I'll try to reason with it. You will not. This is what I do. Okay, I'm gonna save here, that way if I die again, because... I'm so used to that. In case I fuck up, and I'll just come right here. Oh, she's good. Huh. Eddie? Talk what? to me, Eddie. Tell me what's troubling you. Troubling me? He is! It's too dangerous to leave Leah. They all are! They all are what, Eddie? Accusing me! They think I killed her! Because you probably me. did. Oh. But fear. I didn't! This I didn't! Cross. I believe you, Eddie. I believe you. <coughs> okay. I was supposed to come down here. Oops. Oh, I gotta go down even more. Steady now. Steady as she goes. Oh, I was about to say, wait, I thought it was a, a mash button. No, it's just a uh, timed X. Because if I didn't press X, I'll probably fall off to down to my death. Like, oh! Ah! I uh, know we'll help scream needed for that. Whoa, whoa, what's that noise? Oh, whoa, what? Oh, shit! Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. <laughs> What's that noise? What sound is like it fell? I'm gonna shoot everybody. Quickly, 
talking about. You stay still. Let him go, Eddie. Everything is all right. Slowly, Mr. <laughs> Come here! Oh shit, Leah! Bloody fool. Okay. I gotta be sneaky. Seems intact. Now for some ammunition. There's a bolt right there. Bits of bone. Should work if I'm careful. Shoot Leah in the back of the head by accident. Oh shit! Seems intact. Let's hope this doesn't snap under the strain. Oh, okay. Leave me alone. Yeah! Bite into that pizza bitch! Oh shit! Oh, that was okay. That was kind of cool. Hold still, you bastard! Wait, what are you doing? Andrew, Andrew! No. Oh shit! Hey, look, another rune. David? Oh, I'm unleashing my X-Men powers. I'm psychic. He just floats as he just appears, like. Whoop. Am I getting X-Men powers? Holy shit! What? What happened? Relax. Everything's fine. Cool. Fine? Are you out of your mind? Oh, please, contain yourself, Andrew. You almost I most shot the child. will not. And I'm not spending another moment in this madhouse. I will fetch the police from the village immediately. I don't think that would be wise, sir. Are you threatening me? Perish the thought, sir. I am merely pointing out the folly of driving these roads in the dark. Our cars have lights, and they can besides, drive. We may need the car if Eddie's condition worsens. The insane brat can jump off the roof for all I care. I, for one, will rather risk my life out there than in here. Leave then! Ah, oh, shit. And before you even think of telling anyone what happened here, just remember who you are dealing with. And yes, you may consider that a threat. Angus, kindly help me with young Eddie. Careful now, just take it slowly. I'm sorry I didn't believe you. You Science saw the ghost too? Took a beating tonight. After seeing what happened here, I think even Dr. Freud would agree with you. The mirror. I think it's some kind of dark force, a, <clears throat> an ancient evil summoned by the druids. Funny, it doesn't look druish. Control over it. I believe they never had control. I need to check up on Eddie and make sure he's alright. Uh, have you forgotten that he tried to kill you? <laughs> so, I'll be careful then. He's a person in need, no matter what he did. My father tried to destroy the mirror. To end the evil, but he failed. Now he's trapped in there. Are you talking about his soul? Yeah. If that's what you want to call it. All I know is... I... We have to find a way to free him. Edward knew of the mirror. He may have even understood its power. So we know what it is, but not where. It's underground. Somewhere. Reaching it. Well, that's the real conundrum. And how not to end up like your father. Is there this, a sewer system in this place? This is Edward's lair. And Margaret was none too eager on us prying. So we should pry. Indeed. Pry it open all the way. Another one. Like the symbols carved on the rocks. 
Rory. Yes. He might know what it means. He'll probably be asleep at this late hour, though. The first time I met him was in the dead of night. So who knows? He might get lucky. <laughs> Let's see if we can identify it by the picture we take. He's fucking blind! Ya kin? He can all see shit. Son of a... Rat Another bitch. Book. It belonged to Angus. There's a page marked. It details how to perform a cesarean section. Does what? that mean that Angus... Delivered Cecilia's baby. That way they could keep it out of the public eye. Horrifying. Gross. Examine the deer. Inside the deer. This place must be a dream for a psychiatrist. Oh, nightmare. That's all. That's all, folks. The blood stains on it are old and dry. Ooh, raw alcohol. Ooh, raw alcohol. He didn't want to do his delicate work in the dark. Just how far does the official Gordon estate reach? Cross that whole map. Empty. Another of Eddie's horrors waiting to happen. So Eddie was fucking drunk, of course. Yes, and Eddie. The family that slays together stays together. Wait, wait, wait. Is Eddie Angus's kid? Eddie is truly desperate to be a great Gordon like his grandfather. I wait. Is he really his kid? I never made the connection there. Looks like this is where Grandfather Edward did his work. Wait, wait. There's some. There was a take first. Yeah. Photo piece. More photo pieces. This looks interesting. Hmm. This look. Well, examine it, stupid. Oh, well, he did. You were probably looking for this too, Father. Eddie had too much respect for the old man to just break this open. Something's missing. Wait, oh, that's the uh, master key I gotta use. Eddie already took everything he could find. Looks like it is part of the key father hid away for me. Looks like it is part of the key father hid away for me. Does it go on the master key? Still not complete, it seems. Oh, shit. Hang on. I think I did it. Doesn't fit like that. Okay, hang on. Okay, cross to the left, circle to the right, and crew V hits at the bottom. Oh. Okay, the bottom part. No, no, no. There we go. Doesn't fit like that. Ah, son of a bitch! It's got to be reversed, doesn't it? You know it. Doesn't fit like that. <coughs> Hang on. Am I doing something wrong here? Doesn't 
doesn't fit like that. Ugh. What do you mean it doesn't fit like that? That's the perfect... Oh, because that bit right there. There appear to be more missing parts. But how many? So that's right. I think. And that's got to be it. Yeah, there we go. To my dear father, Edward, you stopped me from ending my torment many times before. But on this occasion, I'm determined you will not. I do this not for myself, but for my <coughs> child. A child that should never have been. Hey. A child born. Not from love, but from cruelty. I'm taking my baby with me to save it from this rotten family. For it does not deserve to be cast into this world and into this damned place. Cecilia Gordon. Oh, 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 okay. What does it say? A lot of shit. The ramblings of a lunatic. He talks of a place of great power in an abandoned village. Any mention of where it is? No such luck. Just that it's where, as he charmingly puts it, his whore of a mother pushed him out into the world. He was <coughs> in this village. At the place of power. Yes, but it puts us no nearer to finding it. It does. His mother will know the location. Of course. Rosemary. Rosemary. This look. Okay. Time to go talk to Rosemary. Okay, apparently not this way. Found anything yet? Only a few reasons for bad dreams. <laughs> Jolly good. All right. Okay, I can't go there. Oh, that's right. I always keep thinking I can't go past her, but I can. All right, Rosemary. Need to talk to you, girl. Ugh, the stench. It reeks of death down there. That foul smell might lead us straight to where we need to go. We're gonna go through a sewer! The way to the mirror might be through that abyss. Perhaps. It's too dark to see what's down there. Throw your candle down there. Um, I need <coughs> some more time. Oh my god, girl, what the hell? Found anything yet? Only a few reasons for bad dreams. Look, I found all the clues. Let's just go. Okay. I should be able. Eddie didn't want to do his. Oh, oh. Ooh, raw alcohol. Cheers. Oh, we're gonna make a Molotov cocktail. We made a Molotov. Noise. Am I gonna find Cthulhu down there? <laughs> oh shit. So this is where Eddie dumped the bits he didn't need. <coughs> Who knows how far down these chasms go? Or how vast the caves below are. The castle may have been built on top of wherever the mirror is kept. It doesn't look like we'll get any closer to it from down there, though. Alright, that's all the clues. Let's get out of here. Gotta be, anyway. Let's go talk to Rosemary. Um, I need some more time. What the bloody hell do you need now, woman? I solved the mystery. Let's Found go. Anything yet? Only a few. I need more time to stand around while you go solving the mystery. I 
I think we should get moving. Unless you still want to look around some more. Oh, piss off. Oof. I was ready to go and you kept saying, Hey, I got shit to do. I'm just gonna stand around here. But I need to study more things. You're like as bad as Kyoko. She may be the ultimate detective. Oh, it's fine. I spoilers. Mr. McKinnon. Master David. Do you see how she ran there? She's like... But lady, like... How are you coping? If you don't mind me saying, you look like you could use some sleep. After seeing what happened in the old wing, I doubt I will ever sleep well again. Yes, How's Eddie? I know exactly what you mean. No, sir. I do not think you do. You cannot sleep the way I do. How is Eddie faring? The young master is in bed. We've been <coughs> sure he's comfortable and cannot do any further harm. Up I'd like belts. to speak to him, to help us understand why he did what he did. Lady Margaret is sitting with him at the moment. I'm afraid he's in no fit state to talk. Okay. I hope he managed to sleep soon. Thank you, sir. As do I. Oh, Rory the gardener mentioned he wanted to speak with you. He's in the library. Thank you for letting me know. Thank you, Angus. Maybe you're not such a dickwad after all. You're not a hard ass. Uh, girl, get... I can't see shit. Get over here. Go back out to the main hall. From there, just go to the library. Library. I like that foreboding music I like to do 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 like darkness all around. What you doing hiding in the dark, Rory? Creepy old man. Is it dark? I can't tell. Hello, Rory. What brings you to the library in the dead of night? I don't rightly know. I woke <laughs> up. Something uh, feeling made me come here. I thought I could try reading I a few see. books. I can. I wasn't a much of a help to you earlier. It is not easy for me to trust folks. From what I've seen of this family, I cannot entirely blame you. It's okay, Rory. Edward's diary mentioned an old, deserted village somewhere nearby. I can it. I haven't been up there in years, though. It is a fearful place, so it is. What happened? Why was it abandoned? The folks there were all killed, all dead, wiped out overnight. Nobody goes there anymore. Can you take us? But Edward did. I. How did the village die? It was the druids. The druids using the black mirror. Aye, aye, it was. They got what they wanted, drove back the Romans. Aye, that they did. But it cost him. Cost him dear. Can you take us to the village? No, son, I canna. Can you drive us? Not what it was, you can. And them woods are not safe with no map to guide you. I can get you across the loch when you can the path, though. <laughs> can you drive us? I don't know, he's fucking blind. Do you think he could drive a goddamn car to the village? Alright, I guess the next thing to do is just talk to Eddie. <laughs> Take us to the village! We know you're blind, but you can probably drive by feeling it. Feel what? The air? God damn it, you're so dense sometimes. Uh, 
<laughs> People say rosemary, but it's like rosemary. Hey, rosemary. Hello? Help, I've fallen, I can't get up! The poor woman. How could Edward do this to his own mother? He was a monster, that's how. Hey, Rosemary. Rose? Rosemary, it's me, it, it's David. I need you to help us. The village where Edward was born. <clears throat> Can you point to it on this map? Can you do that? Oh, nothing. It's like she's shut down. Just a second. Mary, point to the map. Try now. There. That's where the village is. <coughs> this ought to be enough for Rory to help us find the village. We'll need a boat to get across the loch. There's <laughs> one at the lakeside. All right, we're gonna go sp explore a spooky mansion or spooky village. Leave crazy grandma to her uh, circles in ash. <laughs> he just rises from the floor. Let me go, graphics. Hey, Rory, we know where to go. Can you take us now? I I can take you. I'm blind, but whatever. I can feel my way around. We know the way to the village now. Well done, laddie. You both go on ahead and ready the boat. I'll see you doing at the jetty. What? No, we can find it ourselves. It's cold and dark outside. I ken the weather, lassie. I'm nae some bairn. I'm nae some bairn. Too old to walk up a hill. Or wipe your I ass you with won't my take stick. No for an answer. You say that right, and I can what's up there mair than you both. Mair, I like I like his I love his accent it's so awesome. I can I can whip your ass, laddie. Uh, just that's the wrong kin. I wonder what can. It's probably just plain old can. I can whip your ass, ya kin. Let's see, fastest way would probably be through the kitchen, or the dining hall area. Or wherever the hell this one's part is. Leah, you really gotta pick up your speedy, th speed, speedy there. Your speed there. I'm walking faster than you could be walking. <laughs> That's not a good sign. Come, Dr. Leah. The Bayon Body Banks and Bayon Body Brace. See, da da da, Loch Lomond. This is not Loch Lomond. <laughs> 
this isn't going to move. Give me a hand. I'm not surprised. By the looks of it, it hasn't moved in years. <coughs> it's going to take more than me and you to get this into the water. Yakin. Do we have anything to push? If we find a long stick, we might be able to move it, bit by bit. David, that would take forever. There must be another way. One where we don't have to break our backs. Take the car and ram it into the boat. Man, I have these pieces to a castle and I don't even have the... Don't even get to play with it. Andrew really has left on foot. I hope he finds somewhere warm soon and unharmed. He was a fool to leave. And it won't make our lives easier if he does drag the authorities up here. You're starting to sound like a true Gordon. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna use this car. The keys are here. Margaret won't be happy if we use the car to push in the boat. All the more reason to do it. Ah! <laughs> do you know how to drive? You don't. There's easier ways to get around in India. Like elephant. Aye. What, you're not gonna hold my hand? Ass. Okay, so I'm gonna take a long shot in the dark and say that Loch is Scottish for lake. Oh! Yo, what the fuck? Somebody kidnapped Lady Margaret. That's bloody well not good there. Eh? Bleak place and so quiet. Quiet? You, you mean you can't hear? We hear the voices of the damned. As will be the fate of anyone who dares oppose this family. Hear what? The voices, screams. I, I, I'm not sure. I think I can hear something in the distance. Rory, are you gonna be okay, we dude? We need to keep moving. Edward must have had some sort of hideout up here. I guess it's near the place of power he wrote about in his diary. How will we know if we found it? Rory, are you gonna be okay? You can almost feel the deadness of this place seep into you. That you can, laddie, that you can. I have not been here in many a year. I didn't ken the place so well. Wouldn't have a clue where it would hit out. Hit it. Is everything all right, Rory? It's the bloody voices, laddie. I'm trying to keep them out, but they're loud and strong. I hear you. We'll keep looking. I'm not going anywhere, laddie. Oh, we should show this to Rory. Yeah, like, how the fuck is he gonna- Hey, look, Rory, there's a thing on the wall. Oh, uh, what do you mean? Do you know what this is? I can it. It's a symbol the old druids would have used in their rituals. Okay. We'll keep looking. I'm not going- 
Can you read this? I'm blind! How many fucking times do I have to tell ya? Yay! What could this mean? Oh wait, shit, I'm already here? Oh, wait, maybe this is not the right... Yeah, this is where, this is where his dad died. He did the rune shit and everything here. But I guess this is not where I'm supposed to be. <laughs> it's like a goddamn maze in here! Ooh. Ah! Ugh. Wait, really? It just loops around? Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Don't do that. We need to break this open somehow. Get a rock. What the hell? You said you weren't gonna... Ooh, the voices of the dam are coming- Whoa! Can you hear me? It's not like you're not. You can't see that. I tried to protect you. I didn't mean to harm my life. I didn't. It was just a bear. Just a wee bear. Let him go. We need to keep moving. Wait, let me take control, damn it. <coughs> I didn't get a chance to explode the rest of the shit. Alright, alright. Well, we're leaving. I want to explore first. <laughs> yeah. Follow me, Leah! We're going to explore this whole goddamn village. Okay, we're going in circles, apparently. Oh, okay, so there's that. Running upstairs is not very gentleman like. You gotta walk. Ah. Okay, so we're back where daddy killed himself. <laughs> is that like the lady version of the Wilhelm scream? Okay, okay, I think we explored everything we need to explore. So it just seems to all loop around. Oh! Cool. 
This handwriting, I recognize it. It's Andrews. Andrew? The lawyer? This is his workplace. The hell? The fool. He's trying to release Edward, free his spirit from the mirror. Do you think there's also a way to free your father? <coughs> Perhaps. The difference being that whatever is left of Edward, what I've seen, I'm not sure he's of this world anymore. Edward's birth was during some kind of ritual. They thought he would have a unique connection to the Black Mirror. And Andrew thinks he might have inherited this trait from his father. Exactly. Which shows he knows nothing about what the Mirror is capable of. Or is beyond caring. He's just here to commit evil. You know. As the main villain, probably. There must be an entrance beneath the house that leads to the Black Mirror. This is what Andrew's looking for. So Andrew's the evil one. Oh man, my lawyer sucks. Andrew keeps referring back to a spot nearby. It must be Edward's place of power. Is that all of it? No sign of human or any life, really. The architecture of this place, the tunnels, huts. If only we had more time to explore it thoroughly. Yeah, because we are archaeologists for sure. Listen to this. Edward may have had his faults, but he was not weak like my mother, who carried her weakness to the end when she took the coward's way out. Cecilia's baby didn't die with her. It's Andrew. Oh, shit. He played me from the beginning. So I've read these out of the order. Oops. Here has been disturbed. Oh, my God. Andrew's the villain. Oh, no, don't. Oh, you fucking. Okay. Let's uh, fix that little mishap there, shall we? <laughs> I'm pressing the place, can't move! Oh fuck, quick, 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 load the game! Load the last save point, which is right here! Oh, thank god. This handwriting. Andrew. This. Listen to this. Edward. And Andrew. Th exactly. Yep. Which shows he knows nothing about what the mirror is capable of. I'm sorry, I read these clues out of order. There must be an entrance. The fool. He's trying to release Edward. Do you think there's also a... Aha. Andrew keep... Oh, the soil here has been just... Oh god, why do I keep freezing? Oh. The, the missing pages oh, from the thank god. They might detail the rituals Andrew is trying to complete. They're badly burnt, but maybe we can... Oh boy. Oh boy, it's time to solve this puzzle. Oh boy, this is gonna suck! Uh. 
Ugh. Uh, shit. Um... The soul! I can read that. No, that doesn't go there. Hey! It clicked! Okay, those go together. Like ramma lama lama dicky dick dick you don't Nope, that don't go together. No, that looks like uh, Sorry, if I'm like up in the camera this business here. Okay, so that goes there. Yeah! Cool! We're getting it! We're smart! Yeah! We're smart! We're getting it! No. No. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I think that goes over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. We're doing it. We're doing it. We do it. No, that's not. No. Yeah, there we go. It's getting it. Yeah, we're doing it. I'm so smart. I'm so smarty. Yeah. Yeah. I do it. I do it. Yeah. I'm so smart. That's as good as it gets. Let's see what we can see. Not much. The blood of three. <coughs> the soul of one. What does? Christ! What is this? What's happening, David? A dream within a dream. Stay close to me. Done this together! Oh, shit. No! He can't be allowed to return! Come back! Come back here! Andrew, what the hell? Oh, shit. Another page from the Chronicles. Okay. A ritual of protection. Andrew seems to have tried to stop my father from enacting some kind of guardian ritual. Did your father complete it? I don't know yet.
Looks like we're going to be solving more spooky mysteries in the next episode of Black Mirror. Everybody, thank you so much for following along. If you need to study the action, the episode will be on my channel later under the Auto Samurai. Hit like, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. See ya!